Hey, orange one here. So we're back at the lab entrance, and it's kind of weird. Um, since the last episode, I I went up to the surface, and I was unloading things. And I couldn't find my companions, so I had to go reload an old backup and save these people again. But we got, I think, yeah, this is a different name. I'm almost positive. I don't think Dortha was the person we got before. Anyways, I've told these people just kind of wait here, and hopefully they don't disappear this time. I think they were, like, in the vehicle, and, like, I don't know, I, like, updated the game or something, and they were no longer in the save file. So, like, I couldn't see them at all. Um, yeah, I don't I don't know why. It just was a little thing that happened. Um, so we're going to be basically, in this episode, just going back down uh, with Harvey killing some ants, maybe a little melee uh, this time, and um, we'll see, we will see exactly how this goes down, but I'm pretty sure that Harvey's just gonna carve right through the ants, yeah, he's, he really is, which will allow us to get down pretty quickly, um, my goal is to just uh, get as far down as we can, because I haven't really done that in a while. There are a ton of eggs here. That is strange. I don't remember leaving so many around. Um, I wonder, can Harvey eat those as well? I'm just curious. Like, if I um, go over to one of these ant eggs, I'm just going to try and give him some. And there are a ton of these guys. There we go. Thank you. And then, nice. Okay, I, if I go and pick that up and then try and feed that to you, will you eat it? No, you will not. Okay. Fine. Maybe I should cook some of these. I think if I cooked these, he would eat them. So I'm just going to pick up a couple of those just as some food for him. Um, there is some downstairs here. Okay, cool. Let's take that. I'm not going to worry about killing every single last ant because it's just going to take forever if we try to do that. Um, do you have a gas mask on? I don't think you do, so I don't think you will follow me if I try and go down here, will you? No, he, he, he won't. Okay. Good to know. Kind of makes sense. Um, let's try and find... Oh, uh, there's some downstairs just over there. Cool. Yeah, it's... um. I, I have had a hard time remembering what I've done, especially seeing how this is kind of like, you know, a weird episode where we've been down here kind of, but then I had to reload something. I think basically I, I had cleared out, oh look at that, that's pretty cool. I don't think, yeah, we've been down to this floor. So we'll, we'll go down here, um, why don't we get the gun out. And let's see, what else do we have here? Gasoline, fuel cell, CVM, eh. That's intriguing. Um, I think there's probably like ants out here or something. Yeah, uh, maybe not. Oh look, another CVM room. Cool. This one's empty though. That's a shame. Yeah, I think that um, I just need to make sure that Harvey doesn't get like completely blasted by a turret and to be completely honest with his health even if he did get hit by a turret he'd probably be fine you know so I'm not too worried um sounds like footsteps so that's probably ants then huh um Northeast and above, I'm hearing... Yeah, I don't think that this is anything but ants, but I just want to be cautious. Eh, it's a zombie. Not that bad. We can easily kill a hazmat zombie. Oh, I hit them for one damage. <laughs> oh, I've got my gun out. That would explain that. Yeah, I hope that we can... Um, hopefully find some medical mutagen or something in here. Ammonia, that's pretty nice. 
I'll definitely take ammonia if I can. Of course, I think, yeah, we're gonna need to get our backpack back on. Yeah, basically, um, I think in the last episode, from what I remember, we had cleared out a bunker, so I just haven't done that. Um, but I don't think we did much more than that bunker, from what I remember, right? So I think that it's fine for us to come down here and just push further, because I don't think we've done this, actually, in this save. So this will be kind of cool. Um, pushing further into lab, and I'm hoping, I am really hoping, because it's been a while that we get to the finale um, for this lab soon. <laughs> and hopefully then we can start doing like farming and whatnot. Um, that looks like there's been some explosives used around here. And that is my 50 cal turret that is friendly. Hello. So if I deactivate you, look at all that 50 cal bullets. That's a pretty good, uh, pretty good haul there. Yeah, I don't mind not getting the bullets that we got from those uh, Kevlar zombies if I get that. I am just curious. No other robots in range. Um. It looks like, yeah, that's where we started from. And I bet that there's, uh, I, I was hearing, wait, shocked or, yeah, that's also a friendly one. What is this? Like, if I look at that. Inactive shock cannon. Oh, so that's like the, the thing that I had, that's kind of weird. Huh. I suppose I could disassemble that, couldn't I? And that would give me another shock cannon. Not that I need it. Oop, nope, not debug mode. Ah. I I switched between my button modes. Um, southeast and buff, I'm hearing whales, so that I think is an ant. And there's a juggernaut there. Um you know what? Harvey could probably kill a juggernaut. Melee, from what I remember. Um, but he doesn't really need to, you know? Yeah, I don't know. Let's do it. Let's, let's have Harvey punch this guy to death. Hello. I'm just gonna hang out over here. And Harvey, hopefully you don't get whacked, but if you do, you should fly in a way that's not gonna just completely don't destroy you. Oh, the Juggernaut's actually kind of hurt. And it's struggling to stand. And the nice thing is that Harvey, he's got low encumbrance, so I don't think this guy's gonna have an easy time hitting Harvey. Yeah, nice work, man. Dude, if he kills this thing without getting thrown. Man, look at this. He's even advancing on him. Oh no, he, he did get hit. Okay. How are you doing? Eh, I don't think he actually even took damage from that. That is insane. He's like a better version of a juggernaut. <laughs> right? Um... Okay, well that means that this room should be clear. No, stop. Google. Just start recording me. <laughs> it thought I was trying to ask for some help or something. Oh man, a tank? What? Did that ant kill a tank? No way. That doesn't seem right. Maybe there was like a robot or something that was around here. I feel like something else killed at those tanks. Um, there's, yeah, there's like a robotic cop corpse there and some other stuff and a riot control robot. Yeah, there was a big old battle here, it looks like. Um, yeah, poking around the corner. Maybe we should just wait for a second. Oh, look, a little lab journal. Yeah, just wait for a second, catch your breath. 
like I've, I've said in the past, I just kind of want to get this lab done and then get out of here so the ants stop kind of messing around with stuff. Um, let's see. Uh, can I? Yes, I, I thought there might be a plank around here. Okay, so, um, there are a lot of corpses around here. Uh, yeah, that's why, why don't we just make our way over there. Dissector there. There's a lot of corpses around here. Robot cop is just up and over. Actually, I could just go over here. Alright, that looks pretty good to me. Um, oh, never mind. There's, there's other stuff going on here. Let's just take also maybe a second to look. I could do a little robot army. as something that I was also considering for a little bit. Yeah, actually, it is not surprising that um, that tank is dead. It looks like it like punched its way through like a bunch of robot cops and other robots and <laughs> cleared out basically this part of the lab for me. Very nice. Uh, there's some inactive man hacks. Where were those? I kind of want to turn a couple of those on. There's five lab defense bot. Okay, so now I've got a ton of little man hacks. I think I've got to turn one of those on because they're they're pretty cool little things. And it's just gonna fly around us. And man, there's so much stuff in here. Like honestly, I'm I'm overwhelmed. I just also want to make sure I'm not running out too much because there could be something waiting around the corner for us. Oh look, there's a Mossberg. What is that? Um is that a shotgun? I think that's a shotgun, right? I'm just um, really taking my time. Let's have safe mode on. Then if I do find any little... Uh, yeah, that is a shotgun. Okay. I'm going to take that food. And the first aid. Sounds good to me. Can I see anything useful here? No. Uh, there's a broken insane cyborg. That's remotely useful. Um, I am curious about what's in that little locked room that's in the center there. But I just kind of want to make sure that I haven't missed anything. Like feline and bird serum. That is pretty, pretty dope find there. Sweet. Who's going to get that? <laughs> right. That's that's the question really that we should be asking. Uh, that looks like mutagen. Uh, what was that? Are you okay? Yeah, you're fine. Something's getting attacked. Is it my man hack? There's a standing tank of something. Um, is that what I think it is? That's a science ID card. Let's just use the science ID card. Um, no, I would like to, can't I use the science ID card on this? No, I can't. Okay, well, I could just phase through the wall. There's like, honestly, no reason for me to go through, um, the traditional way. Yeah, let's just do it. You guys have seen this so many times, you know, um, what I'm going to do. Uh, dispense or dump mutagen? Or can I... I honestly just want to see what mutagen it is. Oh, it's just regular mutagen. Can I dispense it? Uh, I do not have a suitable container. So, I'm just going to mark that as mutagen. That is, you know, worth picking up if I can, but not worth um, spending a ton of energy on. Let's just take five minutes. That is, I think... Yeah, actually, where is that southwest you hear? I'll just go to sleep, capiche? Uh, probably not the best idea. 
I am gonna try and wait and just keep an eye on Harvey. Yeah, we're okay. Okay, stop waiting. And we'll head out. And I think there's some sort of robot or something down there, but I just kind of want to get a peek from up here if I can. If I... No, I, it does not look like I can see whatever it is that's over there. Okay, well, um... This is the pr prisoner containment room. So the, those uh, big zombies, I think, actually got out of the prisoner containment room. So I guess that they didn't contain the prisoners. <laughs> okay, so this is another auto docks. Oh, this, I bet, has uh, some more people for us then, right? What's that CBM there? Uh, finger lighter, autoclave pouch. I really want the pouches. That's really what I'm interested in. Oh, there's a little lab coat here. How cute. Yeah, go ahead and unlock. Yep. And then we should be able to get in here. Pouches. I can't believe it. Are we going to be able to get more people? An insane cyborg. Prototype cyborgs. Yes, we can get more people. <laughs> um, are they... They're friendly and passive. So I have already hacked these dudes. Awesome. Can I just um, have you guys follow me into here, if possible? Yes. Awesome, thank you. I'll just take you from here to there then. And hopefully, uh, hopefully I don't kill you. <laughs> uh, badly damaged. I really don't care. Um, oh. Uh, sorry, Anders. I might take some of the ally plating CBMs. Can I? <laughs> I'll, I'll dissect them maybe in a little bit. Um, where are you? There you are. This is an insane cyborg, actually. Are you? You're also an insane cyborg. Okay, so. I just killed the only one that actually was a person. Um, can I dissect you? Is that something I can do? I can. I'm gonna just do that. It's... These are some really good CBMs that these cyborgs have. Like honestly, I mean these are all the bad ones, but there's some really good ones like um, alloy plating like right there. Uh, power storage. Oh look, that's that's a good one. Protective lenses. That's pretty good too, but not worth, worth picking up if I can't carry it. Catch breath. Uh, yeah, that's fine. I've actually forgotten if I I I can't. It doesn't look like I can actually take those guys apart. That's a shame. But. I know that once they're dead, you can get some CBMs out of them. Okay, so that's pretty well explored up here. Did we go all the way up and over? I think we did, but we did not go to the side yet. Or did I go all the way down as well? I think we went all the way down on this floor. No, we did not go all the way down. Okay, let's make our way down and then we'll kind of swing over from there, right? I mean, is that mutagen? Is that the finale? I think that's the fin finale. Yeah, that's the finale room. So we technically are done with this lab in terms of the finale. Uh, prisoner containment, that's not going to really have anything. Never really does. And then, let's see, what do we have here? Just some sunglasses. It was when I, I heard something moving there, but okay, whatever. Oh man, it looks like we, we may be done with this. We may be done with the lab. Very cool. Oh man, I'm I'm actually relieved about that. If that is the end. There's something smoking over there that's making me a little nervous. Yeah, it looks like the robots and <laughs> the Hulk 
Oh, so those robots, all those riot robots and defense bots, those were defending the mutagen. It's a shame, it's just generic mutagen. Like, you can get the, um... The specific ones for, like, different animal types. Oh man, it's super powerful. Um, let's see. Get the safe mode off there. We'll get those bandages. I'm a little bit bummed out about killing that person, but we have two people that we got. Um, where was that 50... That 50 cow was just around here. What's this room here? Yeah, just a bedroom. Okay. Let's get those 50 cow bullets and we'll we'll make our way up. Yep. As much as I can. Oh man, it's gonna not let me. Can I give these bullets to a friend then? Can I be like, hey, um, can you hold on to these bullets for me? Uh, yeah, you can't take all of them. What if I say, and then I did like, no, it won't let me give you only some of them. What if I, I'm just curious if I try and give you some other stuff, what could I try and give you? Uh, maybe we do like that. That looks like that's helped with my stanum enough where I'm not going to get that constant noise. Not constantly, at least. Oh, it's a smoky room. Dang it. Where's the other ways? There's one right there. Okay. Yeah, I think that... Again, sorry about the heart rate, but I just kind of want to get out of here. Is this another butchered human on the floor here? Yes, that is, it looks like. Hmm. If I look at these guys, yeah, like if I look at them and I try and take them apart, I could get the expanded digestive system CBM, android legs, android skeleton. Yeah, you can build like a little robot companion with the android parts, I believe. Right? I might want to do that. Maybe I could get that from the other lab, though, so that we don't have to constantly be de dealing with, like, a bazillion ants. Right? Sure, we'll go up here. That looks good to me. Wait a minute. And it looks like there's some stairs just up and to the side here. I know I really should grab the 10 mutagen, but... I don't know if I want to. Um, there's so many eggs, man. There's honestly just so many eggs. It's just absolutely insane. Uh, can I get that blob blob? Yes, I can. Nice. Harvey, can you... There we go. Thank you. A little bit easier than a skeletal juggernaut, right? Oh, hold on. Uh, yes. Did I actually get hurt there? I don't think I did, but... It gave me a sound like I did get hurt. Yeah, these ants really are not a problem for our Minotaur friend here. <laughs> he just destroys them so quickly. It's awesome. It means I don't have to use my gun, you know? That's how you can serve ammo in this game, is you just make friends with a Minotaur. Right? That's actually a good uh, solution to all life's problems, you know? I mean, that's like the whole, like, oh, hello, guys. Where are you going? Hold on, what? Where are you going? Follow me. That was weird. Is that what happened with my companions last time? Uh, let's see. That ant. Can I push you away from the ant? The ant does come towards us. I want my friend to take care of it. Yeah, what, where did that guy go? That was super weird. 
It's very strange. Um, hmm. Can I tell everyone to, or can I talk to him? Yeah, come with me. Okay, everyone's with me. Let's just let me catch my breath. I'm in pain, apparently. That's fine. As long as Harvey kills the ants if they come. Why are you sick, Harvey? What happened? Did you get, like, hit by an ant and that make you sick or something? Isn't that what he's got going on? Isn't that, like, the nauseous sign? I'm pretty sure that's the nauseous sign. Let's try and close that. Yeah, where's... Where's our friend? He's oh he's he's coming. I think he's just moving a little bit slow, or maybe not sure how where to path to. Oh, the bionics are emi emitting noise and stuff. Yeah, we're gonna have to get these um these people to um some sort of place that we can remove this stuff from. Gonna be an issue. Let's see. Yeah, there's not an awful lot of storage space in the car either right now. That's going to be also a problem for us. Uh, we can put some stuff in here though, so I'm going to just move a whole lot of stuff in there. And we'll deal with it later. Yeah, nice I've got a sterile um, CBM there. Kind of weird that we dissected it though from a human. We got a sterile one. Maybe he had it on his person or something, right? I don't really know. Yeah, we'll keep that in our inventory for now. Yeah, Harvey's there. Okay, so we do have the whole gang with us. Um, I think we should probably try and drive them over to our base. And then we'll maybe do some farming from there. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Probably the best best bet right here, right now. Um, let's see. I think we need to back this up, though, from what I remember. Yeah, what's that right there? Just double-checking. I think it's just, a, yeah, some gallon jugs. There's a two-way radio, but we actually have so many two-way radios. I'm not too bothered. But... Maybe I'll just get out of the ant reality bubble before I end re the recording, you know? Just so I remember, hey, yeah, you don't want to be doing that or around that. Oh, man, I must have... Yeah, I must have looked at, like, a turret or something in that lab because... I don't remember knowing about this mall. Did I already know about that mall? Maybe I did. A small hangar? What? Is that, does that mean that we might be able to get like a plane or something from there? Oh man, I feel like I need to go explore that now. <laughs> Maybe I'll, I'll leave it and I'll come back to it. And if I forget about it, give me a reminder. Because that would be pretty cool to explore. But I think what we want to do is head back to the evac shelter up here. Which is pretty far away from us. That's quite a long drive. But, uh, I think I should be able to do that in between episodes. Like, just kind of make my way up and over again. I think I came, I came from there, yeah. So, I should be able to just drive up through there. Let's turn on the headlights as well. Man, we're just like driving over all these corpses of ants. <laughs> Sorry, I just realized my mouse was there. Has that been there the entire episode? I apologize if it has. And I also realized that we also need to consider that Harvey might be ready to dive into an actual ant um, hill and try and clear it out. Like, did you see how fast he was killing those ants? If I got him and like one other companion who was like semi-capable at fighting, I think you could do it, honestly. Man, hey, man, Mason, you're hurting. Maybe, yeah, I don't know what happened with 
there's CBMs, but maybe the other guy guys died or something from their CBMs um, hurting them. Because I think there's like an acid discharge CBM that they need to get taken care of. But uh, we'll, we'll take care of that for them. You know, we will do that. It's going to take a little bit of time. Because we'll have to get to a place that we could do the surgery. I mean, yeah, they're not too far away. It's just going to take us some time to get there. Um, in any case, I'm going to end this here. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.